Hey, did you get the gift I sent over? Yes, it's completely inappropriate. And I'm wearing it for good luck. <laughs> How'd you know my size? A sense memory. I like it when you touch me, Todd. Well, yeah. I missed you. Oh, I wouldn't have been much good to you. I was up till three preparing for this hearing. Yeah, well, I was up all night trying to find a lawyer to overturn Judge Nutjob. You mean the judge who's making you live with Blair or, or your kids with foster care? The same. So who'd you find? Anyone I know? All right, listen, I'm heading into a meeting. If you need to reach me, leave a voicemail. Gotta go. So who'd you hire? Nobody yet. I'm still interviewing. Oh, hey, uh, my 9 o'clock is here. It's 9 o'clock already? Yeah, he's early. Uh, who is... Todd? Teo? Uh, would you two mind waiting outside? It's a little early and I've got another call to make. We're not going anywhere. Uh, yeah, our lawyer has informed us that you have some information you're willing to withhold if we consent to Matthew getting the surgery. We're not agreeing to anything. And who the hell do you think you are to pump a 15-year-old child? Matthew came to me. And as far as the uh, clandestine kiss, are you planning on using it against us? Todd Manning, Elijah Clark. I'm afraid I'll have to keep this brief. I'm doing court. Uh, it's not going to take long. Like I told you before, uh, I just need to get the judge to let me move out of my access house. All right. I looked over that ruling. It's rather unorthodox, but... I'm confident we can get it overturned. Now, this could take months, though, right? That's why I'm going to go to the judge directly. If he knows you're willing to make an appeal, he'll back down. All right. There's, there's one important thing before we get in bed together on this one. Uh, Taya Delgado can't know we're working together. Taya Delgado? She's opposing counsel in the case I'm repping. What does she have to do with this? We're involved. Ah. Oh. So then she's the reason you want out of your custody agreement. Yeah, I can't really... Keep spending the night at my ex's house and keep her happy, you know? So you want my involvement then to remain? Confidential. Well, you do know she'll find out eventually. Mm -hmm. Work fast. Shall do. Okay, sir. You're hired. Great. We'll be in touch. Excuse me. Yeah, I'm heading to court right now. Now, talk about gilding the lily. You'll never guess who just hired me. Manning. Am I going to reveal the fact that you two were in each other's arms the night before your wedding? It has no bearing on the case, Taya. Goes to motive. Matthew's paralysis is enabling your affair. There's no affair. This was... What Matthew saw was a kiss between two people who care about each other. Mm. Period. And if you'd had done your homework, you'd know he already tried to use this. That's right, and it didn't work. Because one, we don't respond to blackmail. And, and two, because that's what it was, a simple kiss. It was a congratulatory kiss. Mm, I've never had one of those. But from what Matthew tells me, I've been missing out. Listen, I'll take you two at your word. It meant nothing. So then, uh, what are you doing here? I just married Clint. I'd rather not embarrass him the first week out. Especially when there's nothing to it. Who are you trying to convince, Nora? Me or you? You wanted to see me at the Ping's restaurant? It's all about the eggs, son. Eating them or breaking them? Both. So whose eggs are you breaking, Dad? Hey, your mom's, son. I've hired a killer lawyer, so I don't have to live with her anymore. I'm not trying to convince anyone of anything, mm. especially you, Taya. I wonder why you didn't use this yesterday. Maybe I was waiting for the two of you to come to your senses. We're not subjecting our son to an experimental procedure, period. To save your reputation, that's commendable. But then I'll ask you again. If the kiss meant nothing, who cares if I bring it up in court? I told you, I don't want to raise questions that don't need answering. I don't want my brother hurt unnecessarily. Also commendable. But couldn't it be argued that keeping this from him, no matter how noble the reason, is hurtful? You've never kept a secret because you knew that it would hurt someone else? Oh, please. Bo Tate doesn't care if she hurts anybody. But I don't think she'd like her dirty laundry hanging out in the breeze. And 
point of fact, my unmentionables are sparkling clean. They're brand new, if you must know. But to your question, <laughs> I don't intend to mention your little dalliance today in court or ever. Yeah. This from the attorney who humiliated Marty Saybrook on the stand so that her client, Todd Manning, wouldn't be charged with raping her for a second time. Who strong-arm star Manning, a minor, so that she would drop the charges against Todd. See, you only know how to fight down and dirty. That's the only way you can win. We need to know, Dan. Yeah. For damage control, I understand. Look, it won't be necessary. I have plenty to win without it. Right. Mm -hmm. But she'll still use it if you have to. I might just have some secret information, too, about you. I promised Matthew that I wouldn't mention the fact that he saw his mother and father kissing the night before his mother married his uncle. So, this is because you, you respect Matthew? Oh, please, you don't respect Matthew. The mere fact that you took this case proves that. I would remind you that you came here to ask me to do you a favor, which I just agreed to do. So while the two of you try to figure out exactly what you mean to each other, I'll be winning the right for your son to walk again. Oh, I wouldn't be too sure of that, Miss Delgado. I am assuming that Taya took on a new identity. So you're leaving Blah Boulay? And I have to live there alone with all the girls? I'm not gonna leave you behind. Great. Another custody battle. Or maybe the judge will just put us in foster care. Like well, he's gonna put you in foster care, Jack. You don't want us anymore? That's even better. Of course I want you. I want you and Star and Sam. So what's your plan? Uh, I'm going to ask for joint custody. Since when do you know how to share? <laughs> I'm going to learn. If you'll excuse me, I just need to go over the witness list with Miss Delgado. Oh, she's all yours. <clears throat> We've already gone over the witness list. What do you want, Elijah? Hmm? Drop your case. I risk having everyone find out the truth about you. Listen, Jack, I know that you love your mom probably almost as much as you love me, so I'm going to let you have us both, just one at a time. Is this a trick? No. Does it have to do with something that happened at the cabana? How do you know about what happened at the cabana? Dad. There are no secrets at the La Boulay. Okay. Maybe this is a good thing. I mean, you are a man in training. Well, it's like this. Sometimes when it when it's hot, I mean, like outside the weather, I mean, swimming really doesn't do it. <laughs> There's a, a woman. And a cabana, I get it. Right. Well, no. You need to, you need to not do what I did in this instance. Although, <laughs> it was... Never mind. I'm trying to say that, even though I think it was a mistake, I learned something about uh, your mom and me and what's best for everybody. And I'm just trying to do the right thing for you. I, I want to make you happy. If you're happy, I'm happy. Are you on medication? No. You, you got that lobotomy. Not yet. That only means one thing. Tell you. I have no intention of dropping this case. My client wants the surgery. He wants to walk again, and I'm going to help him. So don't you dare threaten me, or I'll whip out the secret I have on your client so fast, he'll make your head spin. In fact, here's an idea. Why don't you run out the hall, get them to sign that consent form, so nobody has to worry about me blowing up Nora's so-called happy marriage. Well, I am as devoted to my clients as you are to yours. They're just good parents trying to protect their son. Whatever evidence you have of any indiscretion on their part has no bearing on this case. Whatever it is you think you have on me has no bearing on this case. Sure about that? You're right, it's Taya. <clears throat> and so I don't want to waste a lot of time taking your mom to court and end up having to apologize to everyone afterwards. You never apologize. And uh, defending myself takes a lot of time, which you know, I'd rather spend with you, so... And Taya. Uh, so that's my pitch. Does that work for you? You and your sister and maybe sometimes Hope and, and your brother. Uh, half the time at level A, half the time at my place. What do you say? Whatever it is you think you know, it has no bearing on Matthew Buchanan's case. Well, but it has a huge impact on you, Taya. 
and your relationship with Todd Manning. I love Taya, and I like that she likes wrestling, and she has some major cupcakes. Yes, she's got nice cupcakes, but I think you should forget about them. And you need to stay away from the Gabbana. I mean it, Dad. Make it work with Taya, because I'm liking the new you.